According to the American Dietic Association, vegetarian diets are associated with lower cholesterol, lower blood pressure, type 2 diabetes, and cancer risks. In partnership with Bon Secours St. Francis, we spoke to a clinical dietitian about the benefits of plant-based eating as part of our Ask the Expert series. After being diagnosed with coronary artery disease, Judy Columbus's cardiologist recommended she switch to a plant-based diet. So she became a vegan and noticed a dramatic increase in energy. We eat a lot of um, beans, legumes. I've lost 30 pounds. <laughs> 30 pounds in six months. Columbus says the benefits are economical too. Our grocery bills like cut in half. Clinical dietitian Jellic Patel says she's seen firsthand how patients have benefited from plant-based diets. They not only improved um, their lipid profile, but they also had just so much more energy. She says that's because the lifestyle results in lower intake of saturated fats and higher intake of fiber, vitamin C, and complex carbohydrates. 75% of your plate or your meal should be of fruits and vegetables, whole grains, nuts, seeds. Patel says many ask if vegetarians and vegans are able to get enough protein by eliminating meat. And you can if you're following a proper whole food plant-based diet. But she cautions vegans to watch out for this. Just looking a little bit closely at their B12 and also omega-3 fatty acid. And says moderation is key. I think if we go 75% plant-based is a good place to start. For example, you can start with breakfast. If you're one that just loves to eat um, you know, sausage with breakfast, maybe we change, change that. Patel has these general daily guidelines for plant-based eating. At least 64 ounces of water, five to seven servings of fruits and vegetables, half a cup of beans or lentils, a quarter cup of nuts and seeds, and that at least half of your grains are whole and minimally processed. In studio, Jennifer Martin, 7 News. To submit a health question for our series, just go to our website. You can click the News tab and then click Ask the Expert. Well, coming up, a move!